Hello guys, and welcome back to Dynasty Playing on Modding Misfits server, which is currently running FTB Infinity Evolved. So we are back. I haven't been recording the last few days because I have been um, in my own apartment, which uh, doesn't have good enough internet for this, uh, for me to play on servers. So... I haven't been able to work a whole lot on the base, but what I want to do this episode is I want to take a little look around and see the world a little bit. We're not going to be exploring a whole lot of mobs, we're just going to uh, go to spawn to, um, that's good. To, to take a little look there and see what Dog has been doing. And, uh, I think it's mostly him who's been working over there. So this is scanning. Yeah, okay. Uh, I think we're gonna play, put this on hold for a little bit. Uh, so that these guys can power up and give power and that kind of sweet stuff. Yeah. So let's jump to the nether and travel a little bit, because uh, it's not a long way in the in the nether. Uh, something went down here, and my portal was shifted. Uh, I can't see now. There, okay. My portal have found a new place, because uh, the spawn portal got ruined somehow. Ooh, look at that, experience points. Thank you. Oh, okay, thank you. <laughs> Just getting stuff now. And, uh, it's not a... F ri it's not a far way for me to travel to get to the spawn portal. Anyway, I fixed it, I put it back on fire. Because... I am, I imagine, a gas blew it up and uh, ruined it a little bit, but that's okay. Uh, so, the spawn portal is down here. Far way down. Um, I would like to have it up top, though, but I'm not the one designing the spawn town. Uh, ooh, I just realized. Uh, Dog asked me if I could remove my old, or my base here. Uh, so I'm gonna do that, we're gonna do that right now, actually. We can, um, take it down, and, um, let's see what I just want. And we're gonna go ahead and, uh, look at this. Uh, I would like to get a little bit more cows. I'm the one who set this up, and I want to continue to take care of it. Yeah, uh, so... This house we're gonna take down right now. Uh, let's see, we're gonna take out the lumber axe, and we have the hammer, so everything is gonna be fine. And this is made out of iron. Okay. That's not too bad. Luckily we have a chest here as well, so we can place stuff in there. Um, but I do like this wood type though. I think it's a really good type of wood, in my, in my opinion. Uh, and lucky, luckily, with the mods we have here, it's gonna be fairly simple to remove this whole thing. Luckily. It could have been so much worse, you know. There. Then we're just gonna go... Like so, you know? I think this is good of us to do. Ooh. Almost thought we were gonna fall down there. 
So yeah, this is maybe not the best content, but oh, I fell down. That kind of that kind of thing just happened to me. Let's see, can I can I reach? Yeah, good, 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 good. There, perfect. I'm not sure how this is working, but I feel like it's removing three by three hole, like not just. Not like how the hammer does it, but kind of taking it as a box of 3x3. Three three. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. Def definitely does that. Yep. That's not too bad. It's um, a bit faster than using one pickaxe and one axe to remove this whole thing. So I, oh, I'm pleased with this, at least. Whoop. And gonna go ahead and take down this as well. Okay. And this is just because he asked us nicely if we could do it. And of course we can. It's not a problem at all, uh, as it's not going to be in the same style as the village is going to be, which I think it's going to be oak and cobble, correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, I think that's what uh, Dog said he wanted to build the spawn town in. And seeing as this isn't going to be in that type of style, I, th I think it's okay to help out. Well, I would have I would have thought it was okay to help out either way, but but you know what I mean, right? I hope there. done. It's okay. There, and now to the rest of the wood here. Then I have to get up to get the framework of the ceiling. Right? And this, and these boys. There. Good. And I'm in... Hmm. I'm not sure where to place it all, though. There. Basically, all finished up. Right? Well, except for that. But... That'll be fairly easily to get my hands on, so whatever. There. I'm up. And we're just gonna go ahead and go like so. So. And so. So. There. There. And there. Perfect. There. And now 
I need to just throw a whole lot of stuff in here. Because I can. And we're gonna get a lot of wood back. So that's good. Uh, I'm gonna take all of this back to my base because mm, I can, you know. So we're gonna keep those and um, let's now take a look around town. So this is where our storage is for now. Um, we lost a powered spawner, which I had, um, which I gave a Enderman head for. So I went out and hunted for an, some more Enderman for that and got a head after some time. Uh, I also lost Uh, I lost my Ender Sword, which I had acquired, uh, which is kind of sad, but, um, it's okay. I can make a new one. And I think that these houses do look, well, they look good. Um, yeah, I, I like this, especially this house, I really love this, uh, on the inside. I have taking a little trip around, taking a little look, and I do love this. Uh, and the inside of that house is also one I really love. If we take a quick peek, I think it was this one. No, not this one, but this one. Because I like, I like this. I think it's interesting, and um, I really like it. So, Doug, if you're watching this, good job. <laughs> I love this so far. And I'm really looking forward to seeing how the village is gonna look when it's all done. And um, I do want to build a house of my own here, so keep that in mind. Uh, I want to help out a little bit. Wait, did that count? Escape, stupid cow. Let's uh, let's mate them up and uh, get some more cows here, because um, I want some more. One, two, one, two. If the last cow hadn't gotten out, it would have been enough. Go away. Okay. So this is spawn town so far. And we also have, or the others have set up a little something else, um, which I took advantage of a little bit earlier today. And uh, that is, uh, they've set up a mining dimension. So that's pretty cool. Um, I want to take a little look at that and the portal to that. So here and there we go. And as you see, you can't just walk into it. I had forgotten how this thing worked. Um, but as soon as you sneak inside it, that's when it works. So here we are in the mining dimension. It's just, this is all, you know, Wait, what's up there? What is up there? I don't know. I um, may have made my own little mining area down here, which is just basically right down here, uh, where I've been getting my hands on uh, materials. Just a little bit, not 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 too much. I didn't want to overdo it. No, look, more gravel. All the gravel I've gotten here, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, donate to Dog and the village. So I have gotten a few stacks of it actually, and um, that's gonna go to the village. Yeah, because why not? You know, why not do something nice for? for the others, because um, we're on a server and um, we should help each other out and uh, have a nice community. 
a nice one as possible, at least. So here we also go. A little bit more gravel, why not? Thank you. Just a bit. I'm not gonna overdo it this episode with digging. It's just taking a little peek around, seeing how things are. And uh, maybe if the others uh, are in on it, we could have a little bit of a base look around at some point. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring it up and try to get something uh, when they are starting when the others are starting to feel a little bit good about their areas. You know, uh, don't want to just do it to do it. I want them to be proud of what they built. Uh, yeah, I'm probably gonna try to do something like that. And, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's see what we can get uh, ourselves into. And, um, maybe, maybe there actually is something we could throw ourselves into. Like, uh, a mod or something. I'm gonna take a look at what I have in my inventory down in my base, and um, we can take it from there. Just there's one thing I wanna do, and that is I really want us to get to the end uh, for better, uh, for easier access for Ender pearls and that kind of sweet stuff. But I don't think it's gonna be this episode at all. We could perhaps go for Enderman hunting together, but fighting and mining I get really focused and I kind of quit talking? That's not good. Let's see, we got one level. We got some food. We're gonna go... Look here, this is the gravel I've collect collected so far. Um, do I have any more room here? I mean, I mean, we could upgrade this one to gold. Let's do that. Let's upgrade. Always active. Go on. You're getting enough power. Um, let's make an upgrade uh, for the iron chests to gold. So, iron to gold, that's not too bad. Let's just do that and that. And that should be enough. There. There. Let's see, if we wanted to upgrade it to... Diamond, we would need a little bit more stuff. So we're not gonna do that quite yet. There! Now we have room for more stuff. That's excellent. I think I want to do that for all of my chests here, actually. So, two and three and four is what we need. Oh. One, two, three, four. Perfect. There. There and there. And the last one over here. There. Perfect. Now we have so much more we can store. And I think that's pretty awesome. Uh, so, we can just go ahead and throw these guys in here. Because I don't... I have so much stuff! I need to get a applied energetic uh, storage up and going because this is bad how it is right now. It's not even fun, you know? Yeah, so you have started to work on potatoes. That's good. Uh, that means that it's soon going to start working on the other type of metals we have here. Uh, there we go. Perfect. Good. Good boy. And we have so much more it needs to process. And um, I want it to kind of fill up here a little bit before I start um, using this one. I want, I want them to work perfectly and I need to set up a much better energy stuff. I think... 
Oh, I think I just got an idea of what we can do this episode. We are gonna work on big reactors. We're gonna set up a big reactors reactor. And I think we're gonna tear down the wall right here, go a little bit down and have it here. So that's what I'm gonna do now. Okay, we are back and we are gonna make a few things. Uh, first off, we are gonna need a big reactor, right? We're gonna need this one, reactor casing, I think. Uh, yeah, nine reactor casings is what we need. So we need graphite, which we can make with melting up coal. I'm not sure if we have a lot of it, so I think we're gonna take, let's see, one stack, and we're gonna go ahead and melt that up. There, taking that out. We collected that, that's perfect. Activate. Perfect. Now we're gonna get graphite, because that is a thing we need. Then we're gonna take yellowium, yel right? And then we needed iron. So there, we should have more than enough of that. And we should be able to make at least one now. Or at least four. And we needed nine, I think. Um... Yeah, like one, two, three, like that, okay? Oh, perfect, we are getting it there. And that should go like so. And, uh... I think we're gonna go like so. We're gonna go ahead and pick up a little bit more of these. And we're gonna make, uh, let's say we're gonna make two. So we have eight. There. And uh, then we need a reactor controller. This is actually the first time I make one of these, so excuse me. Uh, we needed this dude. Okay, that's that's not half bad. There. So we're gonna need a little bit of diamond, and we're gonna need redstone. Okay. Let's just pick up all of that. Then we're also gonna need a reactor power tap, which is probably power tap, this one. So we're gonna need a little bit more redstone. Let's just do that. And then we're gonna need reactor access port. This dude, so we're gonna need there and iron we have and a yellowium fluid thing rod redstone port housing controller power port Uh, okay. Ah, there we go, okay. Okay. So we're gonna get this dude. And we're gonna go over here, we're gonna first off make the control- this dude. One. And then this dude. Almost. Okay, um, we're gonna need a little bit more wood, that's okay. There. We're gonna need a chest, like so. We're gonna need a little bit more wood. We're gonna need there, there, there. Ah, cobblestone, of course. Of course I were to forget about the cobblestone. There. And then we should be able to make this dude. 
we should. Let's do that, that, that. And then we needed a reactor power tap, which was... The one I just made. Access point, control rod, uh, power tap. Controller casing, control rod, tap, there we go. And then we need access points we made, port, and then we are gonna need this dude. Okay, I think that's all we need. I think, um, not 100% certain, but you know what, we're gonna figure it out. Figure it out. And the reactor controller. I'm at a control rod. I needed this dude. I forgot about that. Let's make a bit more of these. How could I forget about the controller? <sighs> so it's gonna be there, 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 there. 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 Perfect. Now, uh, we need to go here. Reactor controller in the su uh, southern middle slot. So south is this one, right? And then we needed power tap. In the eastern, which should be, let's see, um, east, west, this dude, here, and then the access port in the western, there, and reactor access point in, Western and finally one Galorium in the middle. So this dude goes here. Then I suppose. Okay, we need some more. We need some more of these guys. Um. I think it was... Let's see, on the back, what do we do on the back though? Just fill it up? Okay. So there. There. And... Ah! Perfect. Uh, no idea what to do with it now, though. But we at least have this dude, which is gonna help us tremendously, I think. Um, okay, I figured out. Uh, we're gonna need a bit more Gilorium, but um, we are at least producing power, and that is awesome. So, we are gonna go ahead and throw these dudes in here. Uh, all of this. Uh, because we can. So, you. And then we're gonna go and, um, never active, right? And, um, we're gonna need these dudes. Uh, I think I have them here somewhere, but I'm not sure exactly how I found them. And I th think that this side is where we're gonna collect our power from, right? So I think we're gonna go ahead and place this as, as extract. We're gonna build it into the wall here, right here. And um, this dude is extract. This dude is insert, right? This is something. And you know what, I wanna work it into that one. So I need to drag this cable across right here, and we're gonna, just for now, gonna go like this. Right?
there we go right here this is where I want to work it in right there and we're gonna go ahead and drag this across like so because that way we will have lots and lots and lots of power there please tell me I have enough to drag this across over here yeah good so let's see it is emptying out and we can actually work a whole lot more now because now this is going to be filled at all times and um, giving out power to these guys at all times and this is a perfect way to fix our situation here you know so we're just going to do that for now and uh, we're not going to be spending a whole lot of time in here but at least we have started to get some good power so these dudes can actually go away now isn't that terrific I can do this and save myself a whole lot of trouble we're just gonna have it like that for now uh, I'm gonna fix it later on but, you know this is good this is progress this is real progress actually I didn't even think about doing this today I just suddenly did it so I need to make sure that we don't blow up. I think we can blow up. But yeah, progress. Now I can go and mine and I can get a whole lot of stuff. I actually need to empty out of my bag, I remembered. So these guys can go in here for now. At least until nothing goes in anymore. And uh, all of these guys can go into chests, different chests that we have around, right? I think that's pretty good. Like here we have, we're, we're gonna want to have wood, right? Here we can have these dudes, and you, and here we can have all of this, right? I think that's pretty good. Then we're gonna want to empty out from these as well don't need that we don't need that we don't need that that can go into here because why not right and now we can have a whole lot of tools in here instead there also this perfect okay not a bad episode at all if I do say so myself. Um, yeah. All this power. Fuel rods, one. We're probably going to have to upgrade that after some time. And I should probably have dug it a little bit further down. But that's okay. It's uh, it's alright. Right? right. Uh, so these dudes are practically empty. Let's see how fast you're gonna regain your power. Didn't even sweat it. <laughs> awesome! This is probably the most power I've ever had. Oh, why have I not gotten into this mod before? Uh, anyway, with that, I... With that in mind, I think we are going to finish off the episode. I'm gonna go to the mining dimension and I'm gonna mine a whole lot of stuff because now I can really, really work on stuff as well. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna work a whole lot and uh, I will see you guys in the next episode. I do hope you enjoyed this one. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to, uh, to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to have an awesome day on. Okay, I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.